kitchen. So today we're going to make a kefir smoothie that isn't, if it isn't all consumed on site, can be put in the freezer to make kefir smoothie ice cream. Uh, it's a definite winner in our family. I like, I love our kefir, so it's done with some raw dairy. It's actually a long ferment, so it's really soured. So I'd enjoy that but the rest of the family wouldn't necessarily. Uh, so we're gonna add a few other ingredients just to soften the sourness, sweeten it really. Uh, anyone with children realize that they love bananas, but actually they only ever love really half a banana. So you end up with like half bananas all over the show. So what I do is peel them, the remaining half, remaining quarter, and freeze them for a day such as this. We've got some collected blueberries for last from last season. Uh, and they're obviously frozen. Uh, and then I'm really big into the bee pollen at this time of year. Spring just around the corner, full of micronutrients, uh, incredibly healthy. So it's as simple as basically sieving your strong kefir straight into the blender. Get that all done, job's a good one. And then we're gonna just put all three bits of the banana in, and actually gonna do all the blueberries, and then a generous bee pollen. And then, it actually has an ice cream setting, so we had so much frozen fruit in there, you'll see. Yeah.